I just want to share with you a quick little tip that I have learnt. Um, one of the things I read before we left was that because of these types of couplings, they're really hard to line up when you're reversing the van up to the trailer because basically you've got to hit a target that's the size of this pin here. So it's like a one and a half centimetre wide target that goes through this coupling. And so um, they suggest you get a reversing camera. I looked around at reversing cameras, they're like three or four hundred bucks, uh, plus you've got to try and then wire them through the van. And then one of my friends suggested, why not use a GoPro instead? And so when I looked on the forums, you find there's people who are doing this already and you can get like a GoPro and a magnetic mount and you mount it up here on the back of your van and then that actually allows you to line up and see what's happening on the coupling as we reverse up. Now, the only problem with this though is that the GoPro doesn't reverse the image. And so what it means is that when you try and uh, turn right in the van, it actually looks like you're turning left in the GoPro image and it's kind of disconcerting and actually makes it hard to get right. But what I found out is instead of mounting up here, you actually mount it down here on the trailer and point it at the coupling like that, then the image is actually the right way around. So what I actually have normally is my phone uh, in the van mounted on the dash. Today I've just got my iPad because I'm using the phone to make this video. And there you can see the image of the GoPro. And that way the image is actually the right, right way around when you're reversing up the van. So hope that's useful.